The fifth key, I hope you can still uh, follow me. Uh, in the Middle East, we have too much passion. <laughs> you know, sometimes I think when you watch the TV and you see an Israeli and a Palestinian debating, you see how much passion is there in the debate. They almost kill each other. But also, when I hear, you know, many of the uh, very hard, I'm not sure how to say it, but, you know, this hard core of evangelical Christians in this country, they are so passionate about the Middle East, so passionate about Israel, too much passion, and too little what? Compassion. <laughs> too much passion and too little compassion. You know, so many evangelicals, they come to the Middle East, they think they see revelation unfolding, and they miss seeing the little people. And Jesus is not in this big revelation. You remember that story with, with uh, uh, Elijah? God was not in the earthquake. He was not there in the Six Day War. He was not there in the, uh, that big sound. So God is actually somewhere else than we think. He's not in the passion, that loud passion, but he is there where there is compassion. And this is why Jesus said, blessed are the compassionate, because they will experience compassion. And in our ministry, this is what we are interested in, is listening as we heard in the music, listening to the voice of those who are crushed. Listening to the voice of the voiceless. This is actually where God is. Not in that big thing. 